Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to another video and today I am turning 22 years old. Ooh, I don't, yeah, that's weird. That feels weird. I'm old. I'm old now. I thought, what better way to celebrate 22 years of age than inviting my friends over to eat snacks and play video games. For some context, the Halo video game franchise has been my favorite video game franchise for uh, like as long as I've been playing video games. Um, it's also just like one of my favorite things. When I was turning either 11 or 12, I had three friends come over to play Halo Reach with me. I thought it would be an awesome birthday party and that it would just go super well, right? No, that's not what happened. Bad things happened. It was bad. Yeah, so turns out two of them never played Halo and one of them didn't like Halo. So my odds weren't very good. Um, and this was when I was a kid and didn't have proper communication skills to show when I'm upset. Um, and so it just kind of ended horribly. We were all just, none of us really had a good time. I'm pretty sure two of my friends ended up getting in a fight. Like not like a physical altercation, maybe. You know, I'll be honest, my 11 or 12 year old heart was crushed. I absolutely loved Halo Reach and I was so excited. I've been talking about it for weeks. I was like, this is gonna be the best birthday ever. We're just gonna stay up all night playing Halo Reach. After that disaster, I vowed that I would never have another video game related birthday party ever. And that was until now. Halo is too niche, I thought, or not enough of Gen Z plays Halo in order for me to care about it. No, 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 no. Here's the issue. The reason there's not enough Gen Z playing Halo is because we're not making enough Gen Z play Halo. So I figured why not take matters into my own hands and make the Zoomers play. I realized that I was looking at the whole thing all wrong. What if I did it right? Like really, what if I had four TVs, four Xboxes, 16 of my favorite people, and a living room? Like what, what would happen if I did that? And, and uh, also maybe possibly throw in some alcohol because most, if not all of us, are over the age of 21. Going into it, you know, I knew that probably half of my friends would have no experience with Halo, probably never even held an Xbox controller. You know, I'm very much a video person. A lot of my friends are media people, um, so they're like sort of tech savvy, but you would be surprised at the amount of them that haven't played video games. Yeah, it's it's... It's pathetic. It's pathetic. But you know, at the end of the day, I didn't really care if they had experience or not. The number one most important thing to me was and is getting all of my favorite people all in the same room, getting drunk with them, and just having a hell of a fun time. And maybe playing my favorite video game at the same time. <laughs> So with that in mind, I got to work. I started building a training course in Halo Reach where I could walk all of my friends through it, some of which who have been playing Halo their entire lives and some of which who have never held an Xbox controller. So I built the map in a way that I could quite literally walk all 15 of my friends through hallways, meticulously pointing out different guns or vehicles or just different things they should know about the Halo sandbox. Eventually, this led them to an intersection where I would have them split off. One group, the group of people who have played Halo, have played video games, kind of get the, the overall mechanics, they would follow my cousin Oliver into this little arena. And then everybody else, the people who haven't played video games, you know, the weirdos, they're the people who follow me. Basically, I would take all of the people who have never played Halo, have no experience with video games, all into this one area with a bunch of different guns and weapons. And then they proceeded to use all of those different weapons to practice on the people running around in the arena. And after a few minutes of that, we moved on into a big open area where we just sort of fucked around for a little bit. I am fully aware that I've been playing Halo forever and so has my cousin Oliver. So because of that, we're not on the same team. So I will be leading the red team while Oliver leads the blue team. This is a battle of the ages, my friends. What proceeds is the footage that we got throughout the entire night.
killing spree. Dude, you keep sniping me. Can you stop? I can't flip because it's lagging. Yeah, stop sniping me. That's not fair. Suicide. So many kids. Me. How do you do that? I couldn't get back down. You go up in the tower and you drop off. You jump. Oh, I have to jump? No, but you'll make a split when you're blue. Shoot the blue. You should. But I can't get shot by the red people. You should, that should not be happening. That red shooting teammates stop doing it. No, keep doing that if you're on the red team. Yeah, no, keep doing that. What can happen? If you see any red people shoot them. You're shooting at me. That's me, bro. That's why I asked. Am I shooting red or am I shooting blue? I'm red. My armor's red. No, I don't think I'm red. Because you were betrayed by a spider. Wait, am I two? You're two. Yeah, guys, stop killing. Stop killing your friends. No, I was shooting people that doesn't have arrow first, but you say shoot people with the If their armor is no, no, Kevin, listen. If their armor is red, that's us. If their armor is red, I like five times. <laughs> We're kicking ass, blue team. No we are. We're winning. Yeah, blue team. Hey, Jamie, Jamie, and Kevin, you guys should both get in here. Yeah. That's beautiful. Uh, <laughs>
down. That's me. I'm having a blast. Yeah. Why is your kill count going down? Because, oh, I have, because we killed our own teammate. <laughs> Frenzy.
That's like that TV show. Okay. <laughs> Let's game. 